now. So, the King Boo is back again. We have another Zero to Hero series guide. And today, we are going to be doing uh, how you uh, get going in Rainbow Ruins. So, uh, Rainbow Ruins is where your med count can really start the game. Uh, in, like, White Wasteland and uh, Yellow Stadium, you can't really gain too many meds. But um, once you get to, like, Rainbow Ruins, that's where you can really start to get into the... Uh, uh, ten thousands, and then uh, really start learning how we, the powers work. So, uh, yeah. So when I was first playing and learning how all the stuff worked, uh, I was starting really in a in a lot of rainbow ruins. But uh, yeah. So um, if you saw our streams the uh, last Friday, we got oh was it Saturday? I can't remember. We got the uh, knockout. So now we have knockout sorted. And so this is um yeah the powers you want to go for the uh, earliest. Um, it's super super strong. And uh, just me choking some micro there. This is post commentary, by the way. And uh, yeah, so basically, what this is good for is uh, it teaches you to play aggressive, which is good for uh, grinding tier zero, or kind of, I don't know, inside out. But uh, since I've tried to play more aggressively, uh, had more success in tier zero as of recently. Uh, it's also good for like just a general play style, and when you get like uh, other powers like quick shot, and it's generally viable strats in like BFB Coliseum. So. Uh, but just learning how they all work uh, stems from here, learning how to use the salted in the yeah, knockout best. Uh, the best way to use it is you always want to try and go for a round four. Uh, you've got a very strong chance of getting round four if you start sending pinks and then you salted wounds. And then um, once they get up some uh, better defense, uh, you then knock out the, strong, the strongest tower. And then they should normally leak uh, pinks when you remove one of their towers. And it's uh, just so early on in the game, so um, yeah. Uh, other things you can look for are just like when they upgrade a farm or go for a certain upgrade that is uh, not going to help them with pinks overly. Um, that's what you want to do. Anyway, so you can see now how we've got our full salted off. So we have massive eco. And once you've got massive eco, the, f the 100 eco early in the game, uh, sometimes that's the only one you get off, but even if it's the only one you get off, you're getting 100 extra money every six seconds from really on and really early on in the game so uh, that would still make it better than like a super eco boost where you get more than 100 overall but they're spaced out and you're not getting them from as early on and your opponent has to worry more about trying to defend the salted which means their farms won't be as strong and you can just see how strong farms you can get up especially if you get two if you get two salteds off your farms just become you're gonna have to do you have to play quite badly or really choke quite hard uh, to lose from a uh, getting two salteds off so uh, yeah anyways so we're now going to send blacks knock out the ninja because it's the best tower for uh, popping individually uh, strong balloons and now we have a second salted off we've got two plantations versus one of his normal farms uh, obviously you're not going to play the best players so um, it's a very forgiving um, arena you're going to get a lot of uh, very free wins especially if you're uh, played in the high arenas before but other than that it's just getting like used to all the powers especially for new players new accounts uh, you don't need fast micro at all uh, to succeed uh, we're not going to boost in yellows and then knock out his uh, lightning wizard I believe actually we might not do we let's see yeah we, we look like completely like we're going to win you also don't really play many uh, higher level powers in this arena so that's another benefit but uh, yeah, that's the first game. There's two more games very similar <laughs> to that. Uh, yeah, we gain. There might be a med jump. So uh, we get, we've done just quite a few games. Uh, I got my friend at school to play a couple of games. So uh, he went like. He went 4 and 1. But I took over on uh, two of them, which he was uh, losing just to. Uh, well, we had to like go to the next lesson. So uh, yeah, he wasn't going to be late for lesson over. Uh, playing balloons so uh, that was fair enough and uh, yeah. Oh, yeah micro not completely tragic but not very good either but getting better I want to just compare like when I actually get decent at it on phone to uh, what I was at like the start and now and then uh, hopefully be quite happy with the changes but uh, yeah and he's going to play tech uh, tech uh, uh, because his tech is uh, not the best against aggression early in the game, it's almost always going to leak lives, not being able to get up the 3-2 uh, early enough. 
Uh, you can go for your early salted, which is also massive if you can get up, that up at the right time. Uh, now don't try and be uh, fooled because uh, some players will, uh, let's say, uh, not put their dartling like mountain pass. They won't put their dartling down straight away. They'll put it down right at the last second to try and bait a salted to then uh, clean up the uh, round one balloons. So um, yeah, you want to be careful about that. Uh, you can't power snipe anymore, which uh, I think is good. I think it's good on the whole. I don't track how many games I lost. Uh, I wasn't really using really as well in my uh, prestige grind, which was my strongest grind by a long way. Uh, just sometimes to pick myself up a little bit when I was losing, but uh, I didn't rely on it at all, so um, I'm uh, happy with the change. Uh, same with fourth towers. Uh, maybe my like mixed aggression will change a bit. But then again, uh, I've got the NG spec strat now, which I can use to my advantage. As well as um, played the tech quiz for a long time, and um, yeah, so just a bunch of strats I can use. I'm just going to use. I'm not going to do as much of a uh, dartling boomer farm with a damage boost team tower stone and dual ego, which is why I was doing a fair bit before. Because if you got a stall for for like a sniper for for a fair few fourths, you could uh, still do pretty good. But anyway, so yeah, we've got our two plantations up with our massive eco from two salteds coming out. He's going to boost, uh, we have another knockout, uh, knockout off when I salted, and so we see we're going to get a, no we're gonna get a third salted off, so our eco is going to really be through the roof, almost 600, that's like higher than where you, that's like where you want to be at if you're an eco player, and we have three farms down, and he's almost dead, he's going to two life clutch, just about, so we know the game is one, we have three plantations to his one, as well as having a lot more eco. And he has zero lives, so yeah, we won the game. But um, he was never going to win that one. But um, yeah, you can just see, my, uh, we got another single silver this week, so now we're 2-2 two two on the profile. And uh, also, I've a few more meds, we're about 8k meds. I think on my stream, I might try and get to exactly 10k and then risk all of them. Then maybe I'll go 10.5, just in case. And uh, then that's the plan. To uh, put a big risk on the game. That's it. No, so our next opponent, he's at uh, he's at 10.8k meds. He should be in a more pit, uh, giving me free wins on my main account when I'm grinding. But uh, it's fine. We're on Hydro Dam. So uh, yeah, knockout salted quick shot is really strong on a uh, Hydro Dam. So, you know a lot of good players use it, uh, like me. Uh, and um, no, no, I mix it up. I mix. I have so many different strats for Hydro Dam. To be fair, and uh, I hate all of them. Uh, but yeah, so we can see this guy is uh, playing Dart, so Dart is terrible on Hydro Dam, so as soon as someone starts something that is not Boat, uh, you should be very confident uh, for Hydro Dam. So uh, yeah, we're just going to start, we're going to get Salt off just because he got a farm and a Dart and there's a couple lives that he's going to leak, so we're going to get some there. And we're going to boost in Reds actually, that's quite an interesting play. I'm just so confident he doesn't have Boat uh, because of that weird start, and I want to get the balloons to get to the end so we get the full Salt. Um, yeah, the full effects of the salt, which uh, we can see we do in the end. It's our uh, eco goes up so much. So uh, now we're doing very, very good. Uh, we just need to chill out and farm and then send uh, pinks, knockout, uh, pinks, assault, and knockout as soon as he upgrades and then farm and on, farm and on, farm on until uh, we get to a, like, a round 13 and then we can just do a bait and then an all out. And then the bait will normally kill them because it's Rainbow Ruins. Uh, but yeah, so this is just how you win all your games in Rainbow Ruins. You'll get the odd guy who has like your tier 4 powers who uh, you have to practice uh, just beating them like a, a glue storm. But um, no, just practicing, baiting and stuff. Uh, it's what you mainly want to do in Moai Pit, which will be uh, what we get onto uh, fairly shortly. But um, for Rainbow Ruins, just getting used to how the powers work. And getting a little bit faster with your decisions, but again, that again will come more so in Rainbow Ruins and BFB than a uh, uh, more pit, sorry, than Rainbow Ruins because uh, Rainbow Ruins speed is not uh, essential. So yeah, it's quite a card game mode. I can understand a lot of people just uh, chilling in this. They uh, don't want to grind too hard, but uh, we're gonna we grind hard. So uh, we'll show you how to uh, get right to the top arenas. Uh, we used our first knockout because uh, we've been able to get all those salteds off so easily. And so yeah, you can just see how high our eco is. We got most of all of them off. 
And uh, yeah, so uh, we have our one more boost left and uh, two knockouts, so we're doing super well. And uh, yeah, two plantations versus his one farm. We can boost in uh, yellows. He's going to tower boost. I do not think he knows. Uh... Okay, I guess he had tower boost with a lightning, so uh, that was strong enough. And that was our last boost as well. I probably didn't realise. But uh, it's fine. Um, looking for another farm here. And uh, yeah, so uh, that's uh, my uh, Rainbow Ruins guide. I'm going to answer that in a second. <laughs> and um, yeah, so if you just copy this, then uh, you'll yeah, get to a high level in no time. Leads with pinks over the top. Really strong rush, especially with your knockout. So the width doesn't even get rid of the leads. And uh, yeah, that's the game. Hope you enjoyed the video. Streams coming soon as well as more videos. And uh, yeah, have a nice day.